Patrick. What do you want to do today on this lovely fine day? I don't know. I just want to go see the sky. Really, you want to see the sky? Oh, well, I'll come along with you. Let's go. Whoa, the sky actually looks good. Yeah, it does look good, but like, is that all we're going to do today? Because like, we can't just look at the sky all day. I mean, we can do a lot of other things. Like what? Oh, uh, we can eat the sky. Eat the sky. Oh, let's go back and have a long conversation on why you can't eat the sky. I'm waiting, Mr. Squarepants. Can you tell me why I can't eat the sky? Well, the reason why you can't eat the sky is because it's all the way up there. And it's not edible, it's just air. It's just the reflection of the ocean that you're looking at. No. My grandpa told me that the sky is a very nice blue Kool-Aid. That's just a kid threw a Kool-Aid powder in a bucket full of water and threw it up in the air and then the sky became blue. It used to be white. <sighs> Then what happens when a thunderstorm happens? Well, on that day, the sailors throw black dye and white dye and then it mixes to become gray. Then the sky becomes gray and it is gray. But then, when the magic spell wears off, it becomes blue again after the kid throws it back in the cloud. That's what my grandpa said. But your grandpa is stupid as hell. Yeah, just like me, you know, but I'm a little bit stupider. I can see that. Anyways, you want to do anything productive? Uh, oh, I have this new game we can play. Really? You have a game? I would love to see what it is. Okay. I'll just pick something from my box of fun. <laughs> yeah. Damn. We could play with this spray. Patrick, you want me to spray my eyeballs? <sighs> A cool kick. More like kick to the bucket. <laughs> it's a cool one. But we can actually play it, no jokes. You can spray it on my eye, and I can spray it on your eye. Right there. Patrick, this is so stupid. Oh yeah? What if you bring something proper? Fine. Ooh, what is this? A piece of bubble gum that's been dried up? Here you are. I found this. Patrick, that's just a rotten. <gasps> Where did you get all that money? Uh, I don't know. I just found it. Well, you found it? This is like a million dollars in cash. This is a lot of money. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh my goodness, this would be very good. Oh, Mr. Krabs is here. Hide it, hide it, hide it. Money, 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 money. Oh, hey, Mr. Krabs. Money. Money! <laughs> money! Well, me boys, I'm gone. Thanks for the money. Mr. Krabs, wait, someone else is coming. Oh, uh, better hide this money so he doesn't see it. Uh, act like nothing happened. Okay. What the frick? Why are you guys standing here? Oh, hey Andy. Oh, what a nice hair you have. Oh my goodness, whoa. <clears throat> cinnamon, what was the shampoo you used? It was cinnamon. Cinnamon autumn crisp. Mm, you smell lovely, now you can go. You can go have fun. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. I'm here for a reason. No, no, you can come back tomorrow. Don't worry, don't worry. You can have something later. 
Get away from me, crabs. Sit down. But me boil. I said sit down now. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Yes, me boy. Okay, thank you. No, where is it? Where's the money? Mm, a little, yeah, I smell it. <coughs> not at all, not at all. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Ah, ha! What's this? Is this not the money? Excuse me. Where did this money come from? Let me know. Oh, it was Patrick. He took your money. Patrick? What have you done with my money? Sir, I was just scavengering your house and I found your money. Thank you. Hey, hey this is mine. Sorry. What were you doing in my house anyways? I was just trying to pick up the money. Pick up the money. This is my money. The only way I'm ever going to give it to anyone is if someone gives me a boxing match. <sighs> I said the only way I'm going to give it money back is if someone does a boxing match. Yeah, that's what I said. <gasps> Man, boy, boy, give it to me. I'll do your boxing match. Now, now, hold on, hold on. Me boy, I got these two knuckleheads. They can fight with each other. They're gonna do very good. Really? Is that so, guys? Uh, no, yeah. Say yes! Yes. Say yes! Yes. Ah, oh, then it's final. These two will be doing it. Well, I mean, that's not a problem. I would love to see these two wrestle and do boxing and kick each other's balls. Oh, I'll tell you one thing. They're gonna kick each other's balls all day. So whatever money you're gonna give me, you would probably have to pay double to see what I'm gonna show you. Well, then it's settled. Then we're gonna have the boxing match tomorrow morning. Yes, okay. We'll be there, we'll be there. Go to the, you know, the stadium near the bank. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sure, no problem. See you tomorrow. Hey boys, listen to me very, very carefully. No. Be boiled, listen, both of you. I have this rare disease called Plutonia. Plutonia? What is Plutonia, Mr. Krabs? Well, me boil, let me explain. Plutonia is a rare disease that only crabs can get. And I have Plutonia and I need a million dollars for my surgery. Now guys, be on your best behavior. You guys have to work out and box each other, beat the crap out of each other, you hear me? Okay, I, I can do that. Mm-hmm, I can also do that. Great, please guys, go exercise, go do something. So then I can like, you know, make some money and I can use it for my funds and I can, I mean, I mean, use it for my crusty crab. I mean, I mean, put it, I, I, I mean, you mean, use it for plutonium? Yeah, me boy, thanks about that. But yeah, I will see you guys on the day of the wrestling thing. Goodbye. Did you hear yourself think? You want us to beat each other up? Well, I mean, Mr. Krabs had a very bad disease, plutonium. I don't even think it's a real disease, but it still sounds so bad. Well, I, I can't beat you up, you're my friend. Well, this is not for us being friends. This is for Mr. Krabs. We want to keep him alive, don't we? Yeah, we want to keep him alive. So we're going to be on our best behaviors and exercise and everything so we can keep fighting. And we have to beat each other up real good. It's okay if we get a few injuries now and then. We can recover it, can we? Okay. Okay, so I'm going to go to my house and do my work out. You can do yours here or wherever you want. Okay, great. This will be cool.
to the first ever boxing match for our boy Andy. We love you Andy. Anyways, we got these two wrestlers. One looks a little plump in this corner, weighs about 184 pounds, and has a height of two foot one inches. We got Patrick Starr. <laughs> and in the other corner, we got somebody who is about 10 pounds and has a height of 4 foot 11 inches. He sucks up water. He loves all his friends from Bikini Bottom. We got SpongeBob. Da! Love the cooking. It's been a long time. You look very fit, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We have a minute with your boss before we start the battle. I will be giving you two privacy, all of you. Sit down. Okay. Goodbye, everyone. Daddy, daddy. Oh, pretty nice setup you got here. Hi, everyone. Mr. Krabs here. Buy my Krabby Patties. You? You look very hungry. What's your name? Buy my Krabby Patties. Oh, you. What are you doing? That is not good. But you too can buy my Krabby Patties too. Oh hey robot, you can buy my Krabby Patties too. Oh you wanna shake my hand? You are short. You need more Krabby Patties so you can grow. Okay, you boy. Patrick, you're gonna have to fight SpongeBob. He's your enemy. You're not my enemy. Don't worry, don't worry. He called you a dumb bee. A dumb bee? A dumb... A dumb beeswax. <gasps> You want to fight him? No, not really. Well, he called you a doofy. I'll kill you, Patrick. I'll kill you too, SpongeBob. Well, you may begin. I'll call the referee up. Referee? I'm gonna kill you. I hope everyone's very excited for this boxing match. Before we start, I want to know you can use anything you can even grab one of the audience, because they signed a contract. You can grab them and throw them at each other. You can use that skateboard right there. You can throw them out of there. You can throw them anywhere. The only rule is, don't be bored. You can use all of these gloves, all these accessories. They're all yours. You can use them to defeat your opponent. Now, you may begin. In three, two, one, go! No, no.
Oh, Patrick, I should speak to me. Patrick! Oh, I'm just pretending to be like. Oh, really? Uh, Patrick, I will kill you. Uh. Well, 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 well. Got him on the ground. Well then, we have an opponent. Winner, SpongeBob. Mm-hmm. We got SpongeBob as a winner, which means he gets the cash prize, a million dollars from Alex. Hmm. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey, crabs, crabs. Oh, hey, me boy. Thank you so much for the check. Wait, what happened to Andy? Oh, he loved the show so much that he stopped breathing. Andy? Oh, whatever, I'll just take my money and go. Oh, we learned an important lesson, to be nice to each other. Mm-hmm. We were going a little crazy, weren't we? Yep, we were.